I just got out of the shower, hence no eyebrows, hence wet ass hair. But I'm currently editing a video that's gonna be posted soon. I hate showering before the gym because then I'm just like, I'm gonna go sweat and then I should shower after the gym, but I don't know, it's so weird. I'm just editing this video right now that you guys should have already seen by the time this video is gonna be going up. I feel like I'm getting better at this whole YouTube thing. You guys are crazy crazy we are almost at like let me check really quick actually i just want to say thank you to everyone who is subscribing it's so crazy to me we're already at 80,000 subscribers that is so that's insane holy fuck right there focus that is crazy 80,000 subscribers i fucking love you guys you guys are so freaking cool i'm just gonna finish editing this and i i have a story for you guys as the title of this video says i got kicked out of my gym so give me one second and i'll go ahead and tell you guys the story i just want to finish the new video that i'm about to post and then i'll let you guys know was good because because that was crazy okay so now i'm hungry and i'm home alone so i can just say wait lol i'm pretty sure i am home alone hello vlog and this is the other cat hello vlog <laughs> so what we're eating today is super super simple i did want to eat watermelon but i think i ran out i usually just eat my oatmeal plain now just because i don't really get that hungry in the morning because i personally hate going to the gym with a full stomach you know like after a big breakfast so i'm gonna be taking a cup of almond milk super simple I get this at Costco and then this is where I keep my oatmeal I'm just gonna be taking a cup or maybe I should take two half cups and then get one cup actually no I'm just gonna have fuck the struggle of what fuck I don't know how many portions um fuck it let's just go with one full cup of oatmeal then I just add a little bit of water just kind of soak it I actually might just use half a cup of milk there we go fuck it let's just do one full cup actually fuck I don't know if you I'm pretty sure you guys can see me but I'm waiting for Viviani hashtag bike boys now because hashtag no car boys but I'm waiting for her I told her not to rush it's all good yo I can't see shit but anyways i'm gonna tell you guys the story of why i got kicked out once we get to the gym because i don't know i know i'm lagging it's literally been like an hour when you guys saw me in the last clip i put on some eyebrows a little bit of lip liner because dude if i don't put on lipstick or lip liner then i'm over there at the gym fucking licking my lips and biting them all the time that's why i wear lip liner but i'll see you guys when we go to our new gym i'm so excited i i don't know just shit happens for a reason you just gotta roll with it dude and i got new shoes fuck i can't really show them but these are my new shoes someone asked me if they're kind of big i'm a size four in men i think in the regular chucks and then i got these in the same size but they're just like a tad bigger but i like it because i had a break in my other ones and these ones are like perfect i'm wearing them just because i do like when these look a little bit beat up i don't like how they look like super new right now like it's fine but i rather have them look beat up so you look different because you had your hat on Hello. Thank you. Hurry. Wait, I'm not taking oh, long. Oh, you can leave your keys here? Yeah. Day two at the gym. Wait, what floor? The first one. The first one or the one on top? The one on top, that's the first one. Isn't that the third floor, silly? Yeah. Yeah, that's not the first one. That's the third one. Second day of gym boys. We're gonna get ready to work out and then we're gonna go ahead and tell you the story together because Viviani got kicked out too. But we didn't do anything wrong. I'll see you guys in a bit. We didn't do anything wrong. <laughs> this is the little sweater I got from romweed.com. Shoes, sweater, and I'm wearing Gymshark leggings. I always like to tell you guys what I'm wearing just in case you... This is so pretty. This is everything. It looks like a bathroom hotel in my opinion. And they got this, which is dope. So whenever I want to weigh myself, it's going to be accurate as fuck.
Vlog as fuck. I look good on yours. You I look like pink on mine. Yeah, I like mine. Okay, so story time. Me and Viviani both we got kicked out. I don't know if I sh should I say that. I just won't say the name for the sake of the video, just so it doesn't seem like I'm hella calling it calling it out. But literally, the only reason we got kicked out is because remember the very first thing that we did with the fucking music box. So there was a music box. Lol, hello, looking at yourself. <laughs> so there was a music box in like the back room that they have at the gym and they used to tell us to not use it, but there was people who would use it. So we were like, why are they telling us not to use it? And then there's like other people using it. So we would just whatever, fuck it, go ahead and use it. And then I think there was this one girl in the room. I think she complained to the manager that I was playing music way too loud. They told us, I think they told us to stop. <laughs> stuttering. Fuck you! So they told us to stop, and then I think the next time they caught us using the music box, and then they told Viviani there was this manager, and I she, always got blamed for everything. Every time it wasn't me. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so Even, offended. Like if I did something, they would tell her. So she comes in the little room, and she's like, she was like kind of mad, and she was like, hey, you guys can't be playing music here. We told you guys already, and we have a sign right there. <laughs> So, no more <laughs> using the music. And I was like, oh, okay, sorry, that wasn't me, it was my friend, but okay, It we'll was my stop. friend? <laughs> so, <laughs> they ended up putting they a sign and they taped it this time and it said, don't use, like, if you use it, like, we might cancel your membership or something. But people kept using it, so we were like, whatever. And then, so that was one incident. Was so they were already, like... Up, though, because if they were using it, why couldn't we use it? I know, that's, that's why we kept using it. So then, that's one incident and they were on our ass about it, you know, like, le estábamos jugando al chingón, so we kept doing shit. And then there was people People complaining that we would be recording and we would be getting them in the oh, background yeah, so then there was too. that one we don't want people in our vlogs because yeah. that's our vlog like that's how vlogs are people vlog yeah in places. the background so we weren't doing it on yeah. purpose but people so I like understand we're pointing it to people like hey be in my vlog yeah like, like I get where they're coming from I understand that yeah like it's a little bit obnoxious when people are trying to work out and we're over here fucking recording for YouTube but then again it's not like we were intentionally trying Trying to get people in the background they just they just were there so we got in trouble for that and they were just like you guys need to be careful so they talked about they talked to us and they told us not to record in the locker rooms at all because people didn't want to show up in the background so we were like yeah that makes sense but we were like they don't want people to show up so we'll just record in there when there's no one in the locker room so we were like that's fine like a little loophole and then so we started snapchatting a lot in the locker rooms oh, and yeah, don't then that. we got in trouble for snapchatting chatting because again people complain which yes I understand yes you guys I understand that people don't want to come out just in case like they don't have any clothes on which is totally understandable but literally every single time we would try to make sure that there was no one in there but then again we got in trouble for that so it was just things that kept adding on and then this was something that I did so I came to the gym on my bike one day and then I couldn't get myself back to my house because it was raining so then one of the guys that works there was like hey Jasmine I don't want you to go in the rain how about just leave your bike here overnight pick it up the next day and then I'll just take you home so I left my bike there and then the next day I forgot to pick it up because our friend Daisy always gives us rides you look sad so they ended up calling Bibi Ani and they I'm were like offended. hey you have your bike here she was like what the fuck no that's Jasmine's bike that was bike. not my bike I don't even know why they were calling me and the lady sounded like she was like mad she was like you had your bike here for like about a week now or something a like week? that well, I don't know if she, I don't remember, but let's just say she said okay. a week, so she's like, <laughs> so um, we don't want it here anymore, if you can come pick it up, when will you be picking it up? And then I was like, oh, okay, I understand, but that's not my bike, that's my friend's bike. <laughs> ah, motherfucking again. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> I always got blamed. <laughs> so that was the second to last incident. And then the very last thing that just, it was like the last straw, the thing that pushed them over the edge. If you guys have me and like my friends on Snapchat, you guys would have seen that we were, we were just like doing the robot. We were messing around in the locker rooms when there was no one in there. And no then there one, was literally like- no one I in know. there. Literally. And then I think there was one girl or like lady, whatever. She walked by and I'm pretty sure it was that lady. And once she left the locker room, 
she would, I'm pretty sure she would complain to management. She was like, yo, there's these girls recording in the locker rooms and I don't, like she probably was like, I don't appreciate it. So then another manager comes into the locker rooms a few minutes later and she's all like, um, you guys, you you can't really be recording in the locker room. You're gonna look like <laughs> <laughs> We've already told you guys. I mean, this is a warning. I think that's what she said. And then she's like, can you guys please just stop? It's not okay, people don't like it. And then we were like, fine, whatever, fuck it, we'll stop. No one was in there, so we thought it was fine. We were like, whatever, it's just us. And then so the next day, Viviani <laughs> gets a call. Okay. <laughs> Me all the time first. I'm the first one because I'm the one that causes everything. Every time. ¿Qué te dijeron? They called me and they were like, hey, um, can I speak to Viviani? And I was like, yeah, this is Viviani. And then she was like, hi, I'm calling regarding from Fusion Fitness. We're just calling to let you know about the incident last night. And um, we're just going to give you, um, we're just going to cancel your membership. And I was like, oh, okay. And then she just said, okay, thank you. Have a great day. And, and she, she hung up. Clicked. She fucking clicked like that. She didn't tell me, oh, we're not going to charge you for it nothing just as simple as that so to me that sounds like they were it having was like already rude, like huh? yeah like, like to me like, oh, you're and even when they called me for her bike i felt like the lady sounded really like mean and rude yeah. like like you don't if we're going to your gym we're not like and you guys have a problem with us you have to be professional about it you know and the thing is all of the guys that work there were yes. so fucking chill all of the guys they every were single chill. one and then it there was, was like only the girls well most no of the there girls. was two girls that were really nice and like shout out to them they were yeah. super nice super cool but like all of like the other ladies like we had no problem with them but they always like every time we would walk in i would get that vibe like like same oh here come the little girls yeah the little most bitches. of like, like most of the time they wouldn't even like greet they wouldn't us even greet other us. people would be like oh hey what's up and then when we were leaving like after we scanned our little card they'd be like all right have a good workout the ladies they never did that besides like the two other girls that were mm -hmm. kind of like our age and they were super sweet but that's pretty much the long story like of little, why we got kicked out little by little it built up mm -hmm. but at the like same it's time like like it's a bitch because there is people that record in there like on their phones like yeah. they might not do oh, yeah. youtube but there's people that record so when i told when i told my mom and my managers of where I where I work they were like what the fuck that's not cool but then I understand where the people that work at Fuck. But then I understand where they're coming from because yeah, they did tell us repeatedly what not to do But then again, I felt kind of picked on because people were still doing what they yeah. wanted And then yeah. when we did it, we were the ones that got in trouble So that's why okay. we continued to do what we wanted just because we were like if other people are doing it Then why are they telling us so we Wanda? just kind of brushed it up Fuck it. <laughs> We're just a little bumped because they should have told us from the beat like at least a day or two three days before if they're going to cancel it or at least give us another yeah. week. Because like when people get evicted from their yeah. homes, we literally felt homeless. I felt yeah. so lost. I was like, what yeah. the fuck do we do? Like, you guys know that we go to the gym every day. We go so. to the gym every day. And then the thing was they called us in the morning because literally in the morning is most of the time we always ride our bikes and mm -hmm. we go to the gym. So I'm pretty sure they expected us going to the gym. So they would rather just call us in the morning and be like, hey, sorry, fuck you. No gym for you. Bye. <laughs> like, I don't know the rules for gym. But, yeah, but like I mean, it was just like that oh sounds fuck. fucked up. That yeah. sounds pretty fucked up. And we were gymless and we were fucking trying out other gyms. But now we're at Powerhouse, which I want to kind of make a positive situation slash outcome of like when something bad happens, try to look at the positive. The fact that we got kicked out, yeah, it sucked. And yeah, like all of our friends that we made at the gym, like I'm not going to see them as much anymore. But the fact that we got kicked out, it's a new start. now, yeah, it's a new start. Now we're at Powerhouse. I yeah. fucking love Powerhouse. I get to ride my bike here every single time so that means hashtag cardio as fuck forced and then too. yep forced cardio which is gonna make me be more on track okay. and it, like i said it's a new gym the <laughs> environment is so nice here like it feels very motivating everything Whoa. <laughs> Everything just feels so good. The vibes are good. Literally yesterday was our first day and I already made two friends and they're super nice. They're two girls. Shit happens, but I feel like it happens for a reason. Go with the flow. Fuck it. You got kicked out or whatever. We got kicked out, but hey, we're at a new gym and it's fucking lit. lit. <laughs> I lay. <laughs> Damn, people here are so fucking shredded. It's kind of motivating. Oh yeah, and I'm starting. Uh, we're we're actually gonna do cardio because we kind of cooled down a bit. So we're gonna do this thing. How long? Six minutes. Like six 
se probably seven minutes because six is a weird number and I like the number seven. Cardio and then we're gonna hit up our body. Gym time. a good workout honestly coming to this gym literally this is the second day and I've had such a good workout it's been a while I feel that I've had a sick ass workout like this I don't know I was telling Viviani like days like this where I just have like a bomb workout I just feel so grateful you know to still be here and like it just feels so good to be happy but we're gonna head home now I'm gonna go home probably make something to eat and check if my video has uploaded but I hope the footage was good we mainly hit what did we hit Hit back in shoulder, shoulder and back, yeah. so I hope that was good I don't really do upper body anymore just because I've been really really focusing on gaining muscle mass on my lower body just because I want that booty lately I've been feeling weird when I wear like my little crop top shirts just because I don't know I just feel weird so that's why I decided to wear my sweater my little crop top today and it was really comfortable I like how there was really nobody here it was chill I don't know man I just I'm happy and I'll see you guys when I get home. Usually it says that no, my thing failed. So I'm like hyped right now. The fact that I actually was able to upload the video. Yay! <laughs>
of preparing upload. The reason why I'm so hyped is because if you guys have me on Snapchat, fuck, I feel like I always say that, but if you guys have me on Snapchat, then you guys know how hard it is for me to upload videos. For me, I don't know why, iMovie hates me sometimes and I literally have to try to upload one video like 15 times and I'm just like, fuck! But I don't know, that's why I'm so happy because it actually uploaded, yay! So, of course, something has to go wrong. For some reason, it doesn't want to upload. It says, preparing upload. Look, right there, this is like behind the scenes YouTube. It doesn't even want to fucking focus, there we go. That's what it's saying, and I keep refreshing it, but for some reason, it doesn't want to like, it doesn't want to start uploading. Anyways, whatever, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna let it upload, see what, I ha see what happens, I'm gonna make some food. I'm probably just gonna eat some rice and maybe beans and then potato. What the heck, I'll show you guys, what am I doing? I'm gonna try to figure out why my video isn't posted Scene, but this is what I ended up getting first it was like three-fourths cup so then I added another one and then for this one it was the same thing three-fourths cup was one serving so I just got two servings of both of these and I added just a little bit of ketchup but I really hope you guys enjoyed the video I'm gonna get that shit situated one way or another and I love you guys and I appreciate you guys so so much thank you for always being heck nice to me and I will see you guys in the next video Bye.